Good luck, players. Your time starts now. This organ is not fully developed until a person's mid-20s. Kelly. The brain. Yes. This actor is known for his roles in gangster films directed by Martin Scorsese. Dander. Robert De Niro. No. His breakthrough role... Brooke. Al Pacino. No. His breakthrough role came in 1980's Raging Bull. He won a Best Supporting Actor Oscar for Goodfellas. He portrayed one of the burglars in the movie Home Alone. Kelly? I don't have Time up. Joe Pesci. <laughs> this annual event in New York City dates back to the 1920s. It's sponsored by a department store chain. Xander. The Macy's Day Parade. Thanksgiving no. Day Parade? Yes, okay. <laughs> this place is a famous restaurant and entertainment chain. It is known for its movie-themed atmosphere and decor. Kelly. High Rock Cafe. No. Sylvester Stallone, Bruce Willis, and Demi Moore were among its initial investors. Brooke. Planet Hollywood. Yes. This animated character lives in the fictional town of Arlen, Texas. He works as a propane salesman. Uh, Brooke. Hank Hill. Yes. This thing is the seed of a tropical palm. According to a Harry Nilsson song, you put the lime in. Kelly. A coconut. Yes. This is a school in the northeastern United States. It's commonly referred to by its three-letter initials. Xander. NYU. No. It's located... Uh, Brooke. MIT. Yes. This person was a Portuguese explorer. He was the first to circumnavigate the globe. Xander. Christopher Columbus. No. It's a strait in the southern tip of South America is named after him. Brooke. Ponce de Leon. No. I think it's all right. <laughs> Kelly, you buzzed in in time. And if you are correct, that means we have just tied the game. Kelly, what's the answer? Magellan. That's right, Magellan. We got ourselves a tie game. Well done. Okay, so here's how we are going to break it. I'm going to read clues to a final person, place, or thing. When you think you know it, buzz in. If you are right, you are going on to the final round. But be careful about buzzing in because if you're wrong, that means your opponent will be going on to play the final round. Are you ready, Kelly and Brooke, to break the tie? Yes. No. <laughs> no. I know you're ready. Just listen carefully, and when you know when you think you know it, buzz in. Here we go. These things were believed to ward off evil spirits in ancient times. It's a type of percussion instrument. They're often hung outside homes. Most of these make a gentle sound when blown by... Kelly. A wind chime. <sighs> yes, Kelly, it was wind chimes. That means you are moving on to play our final round. You're still watching? Oh my God, thank you. Well, in that case, be sure to stay up to date with Person, Place, or Thing by smashing that subscribe button. There's full episodes, behind the scenes content, and even a few surprises, and they're just a click away. You can go now.